Me Too, written by Annika Dunkley, illustrated by Lori Joy Smith. This is Annie. Hi! And this is her best friend, Lillimore. She's from Sweden. They are best friends for many reasons. Hey, Sean! Reason one, they're the same age. I'm seven. Me too. Reason two, they like the same color. My favorite colors are pink and purple. Mine too. Reason three, they like doing the same thing. I like jumping rope. Same here. And most important, reason four, they can both speak another language. Jakan Pratsta Swenska. Makaloka Oinky Boinky. Okay, so Amy made hers up, but she's pretty sure it still counts. When Amy goes to Lillimore's house, she gets to try all different kinds of Swedish foods. Blueberry soup? Mmm, sounds delicious. And when Lillimore goes to Amy's house, Amy likes her to try something different too. Toast with maple syrup? Yes, please. Sometimes they even try on each other's clothes. I love your Swedish folk costume, little more. And I really love your cool, really cool t-shirt, Annie. And they're the best of friends. Every day when Annie arrives at school, little more greets her with a big hug. But one day when Annie arrives at school, there's no little more and no big hug. Where could she be? It looks high and low in the schoolyard for a little more. And sure enough, there she is, playing with somebody else. A little more than another girl are jumping rope. They are having fun, and they are laughing. And he doesn't like the look of this at all. Hi, little more. Hi. Oh, hi, Annie. To the Lillian. She's new here from France. And he frowns. Both girls' name begins with Lil, Lillian, Lillimore. And he doesn't have a single L in her name. Bonjour, any parles vos bancas? Lillian can speak another language too. And he is not happy about this at all. Now she's the last year that Winky Blinky counts. Do you speak Oinky Boinky, Lillian? Annie decides she needs to ask Lillian some very important questions. Question one. So, Lillian, what are your favorite colors? I have rose and violet. Annie's relieved for a moment. I think that is how you say pink and purple. Ah. Question two. Lillian, how old are you? I'm six. Finally, something Lillian and Lillimore do not have in common. Or so many things. But next week is my birthday and I will be seven. And he can't stand it. Maka kuka oog. She pulls her hood over her head. You two have so... What's wrong, Annie? You two have so many things in common. I'm feeling left out. Left out? Yes, left out. You won't like jumping rope. You won't like pink and purple. You won't like speaking another language. And, um, 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 oh. And he giggles. I like jumping rope, pink and purple, and speaking another language, too. I know. And you and I both have Anne in our names. Lily Ann. Annie. This is music to Annie's ear. Wow, we all have so many things in common. And we can all play together. Yes, we do. Yes, we can. And he's so relieved. I was worrying for nothing. And he had just one last que- very important question to ask Lillian. Question three. Lillian, do you like toast with maple syrup? French toast? Nope, just plain in toast. But with maple syrup. Yes, it wouldn't. This is Annie, Lomar, and Lillian. They are best friends for many reasons. Beans are, of course, not relictis. Absolutely. Ulga bulga meow. That's definitely.
this is the end of thank you guys